awesome. Thanks for the info. Okay. We're gonna start this up today. Yep. Welcome everybody, this is Link. And so And Bugan. Hey. So yeah, we have Bugan on this and sorry about the weird configuration of images on the screen, but that's the best I could do in the five minutes I had to set up before these guys started complaining. Uh, we're here with another update. We haven't update. eaten anything yet. <laughs> well, that's not my problem. You guys were playing Smite. <laughs> okay, so let's get this quickly done then. YouTube, we're at 171 subscribers, which is down one. I hear my dad actually subscribed, though, which kind of kind of weirds me out, but it's kind of awesome. Uh, so, thank you if you did watch. So weird. Thing. Yeah. Otherwise, we're at 4,417 views, which is up 39. That's pretty good. Yep. Not quite as much as we were up last week, but you know, it's still good. Uh, Twitter, we're at 1,363 followers, which is up 6. Facebook, we're still at 113 likes. Twitch, we're at 39 followers. And we're at 695 views, which is up 6 uh, views. The followers are the same, though. So thank you for everyone who checked us out uh, last week when we were playing Xenoblade. Yes. Uh, this week, I believe, we're going to be playing Sonic Adventure, and it's going to be on Thursday once again. Yes. But we can go from 9 to 1. I, I feel like if we really work hard, we can beat that game fast and get into playing Xenoblade again. Yep, and it's 10 to 1, not 9 to 1, right? Oh no, we can go 9 to 1. Did Boogan say 9 to 1? I, uh, whatever you guys want to start, I can start because I'm doing nothing until later, so. Okay, let's do 9 to 1 then and just try to get it over with. Hopefully we can finish it. <laughs> yep. Okay. Now, you guys have uh, Smite stuff, and you're both... Yeah, we do. Uh, we're practicing up again, so we're trying to get ready to start streaming again and not look too bad. Yeah, we were going to stream today, however, E3 is uh, currently going Freaky on. Twitch. And hashtag E3 breaks Twitch every year. Every year. So, uh... I have a, I have a green dot on my... There head. won't be a Smite stream today but there might potentially be one tomorrow cool possibly <laughs> okay <laughs> oh god awesome. what was last week's question was why do you believe bethesda revealed fallout 4 before e3 this year okay and what do you guys think <laughs> i think they just wanted to get it out there because you know they're like oh well <laughs> Now people want to see what else we're bringing to E3 because we already dropped the big Fallout 4 bomb. Okay. What about you, Boogan? Um, I well, I sort of agree with that, but I also think it's it. I I could see it either way because one, in a positive way, it's they dropped the big bomb before, and so people might be like, oh, what are they else? What else are they bringing? It's gonna flock towards them. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, they don't exactly know what other companies have in production so they already used they already used their uh like ultimate attack sort of thing yeah so they can't they already really, forward they can't get any better than they've just gotten and stay uh square enix says oh we have kingdom hearts 3 stuff right here <laughs> what do you yeah. think are gonna happen at the convention when people hear they have kingdom hearts 3 yeah, yeah. they're gonna go to that because they already know that fallout 4 is gonna be there yeah yeah. So they already know that it's coming, and they're like, they've seen the trailer. Or Steam just comes in Left 4 Dead 3 or Half-Life 3. Honestly, if Steam comes in with anything that has a 3 in it, I swear to God, like, if I was at Steam, I would be thinking or of... Or Valve, any, my bad. Valve. Well, yeah, well, if I was at Valve, I would be thinking of any game title that we could use that had the word 3 in the title itself yeah. and wasn't an actual number. So it would be like... Uh, Mailbox 3 or something like that. Like something dumb and brand new just that has a 3 in it so that they can just troll the world. That's what <laughs> I'd be doing if I were them. Anyway, okay. So I'm going to do the comments of the week real quick and then I'm going to get to my answer because it might uh, be a bit okay. longer. So uh, my brother Brett says maybe it was a, all an elaborate ruse in order to get the hype up for them having a booth at E3. Or maybe somebody accidentally pressed the red button that said release trailer for Fallout 4 at the company party. I don't know, pretty hyped for it. Fallout New Vegas was pretty fun. All in all, should be a good game. And uh, I like the way that he put that. Uh, here's what I think, though. And I was doing a little bit of reading online, and I kind of thought about this. 
they release that they have Fallout 4, uh, and they drop their big bomb, as you said. Yeah. Now, that made us all, like, it, it made us think in, enough to make it a question of the week, what are yeah. they going to do then? So it's going to have other people coming there, and it's going to be able to show, uh, they're going to be able to show off more of the game now. Because if they just dropped the trailer at E3, then they may not have been able to put so much effort into showing other gameplay aspects, showing other things in the game. Because we see two different time periods, we see all kinds of things that aren't explained, they have a ton of stuff that they have to go through and explain for us. So, I feel like, originally, I thought like the same as you guys, like, oh my god, they dropped oh my god, the they bomb, what, they what, are they what are they gonna do? But now, I really think that it might have been strategic because now they have this uh, booth and everybody knows what's going to be there and everybody is hoping to see more about, more it. about it. God damn headphones! <laughs> so, have you, have you guys read some of the stuff that they're going to be releasing right and showing? Back. At E3? Uh, I have not. Um, I um, heard. Yeah. Xbox One to be backwards compatible with Xbox 360 games. Seriously? Yep, they're doing it finally. Damn it. Idiots. I just bought a 360. Yep. So there's Bethesda press conferences going on right now, Microsoft press conference going on right now. Okay. And, yeah, so I'm excited. Sort of. <laughs> have, have you have you heard the upcoming games that they're, the top upcoming games that they rated? Um, no. Batman Arkham Knight. Yes. Star yeah. Wars Battlefront. Yep. Assassin's Creed Syndicate. I didn't know it Final was called Syndicate. I knew there was a new one. Yep. It's Final it's Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Okay. Um Final Fantasy fifteen. Okay, yeah. Um Naruto Ninja Shippuden, Ultimate Ninja Storm Four. Okay. Metal 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 oh, fuck. <laughs> Metal Gear Solid Five, The Phantom Pain. Okay. Fallout Four. Yep. Tom Clancy's Division. Yep. Legend of Zelda Wii U. Oh, did they announce that? Yep, coming in 2016, and Mad okay. Max. Mad Max is going to be a game? Mad Max is going to be a game. Okay. And we're always hoping for Kingdom Hearts 3 to be announced. Yeah, um, we're waiting very patiently. <laughs> and, okay, so Legend of Zelda does have a 2016 date, it's not 2015? It's twenty six. It says upcom. It's coming twenty sixteen. Okay, then I'm not gonna worry about it. I just got worried because they said something about they were gonna push it back. I didn't. Okay, I'm good though. I'm fine. Don't worry about it. We're good. Yeah. I just don't want them to push it and have Sonic Boom in Zelda form. Because if there's one thing I don't want to happen to the Zelda series is that they push out a game too quick and it turns out like shit. Uh, when oh, they yeah. could have just waited. Because I will wait and they will take my money either way. So. One way or another, they're gonna have the money from me. Yep. So they're releasing new, or Xbox is releasing new play footage for Halo Five. Okay. There's the Fallout Four. There's some more. Uh, Forza Motorsport Six. Okay. Um, I'm back. I they're doing the groceries away. Um, Ubisoft revealed more details on Rainbow Six Siege. Another Rainbow Six game. I, I don't even know those games. Um, there's going to be more um, indie games coming to Xbox One, oh, such good. as uh, Tacoma, Fulbright's Tacoma, okay, uh, Beyond Eyes, and a new DayZ. Really? Yep. A new DayZ. Hmm. Um, Rise of the Tomb Raider, Fable Legends, Gears of War Ultimate Edition remastered. Gears of War. Yeah, I heard about 1080p. that. 1080p. Hell yeah. That. Metroid Prime. Oh, Metroid. Metroid. There. Uh, Zombies, Garden Warfare 2, Dark Souls 3, um, Sea of Thieves, Gears of War 4, backwards compatibility, as I said, mm -hmm. uh, new Xbox One Elite controller, Titanfall, another Titanfall, actually. Oh, wait, you're giving Xbox One backwards compatibility? Yep. Yep. We, we said that as you were leaving. Oh, okay. Uh, something that I saw the other day was that a remake of Arkham Asylum and Arkham City for the Xbox One, like HD remakes, are in the works. Uh huh. I saw that. Uh, do you know when that backwards compatibility thing is coming through? Uh, I'm looking at it right now. 
Hang on. Hang on. I'm hanging on, this, man. This holiday. This holiday. So Christmas. Okay. On holiday. And so system-wide Xbox One features such as DVR and streaming will be available on all Xbox 360 titles. Hmm. Nice. Sweet. See, I'll just get an Xbox One and then I will plug my 360 into the one. And it'll just be fine. Oh no! Wait, wait. It's backward compatible, which means you'd be wait. able to play the 360 games just through the one. I know. Wait, wait, wait. Microsoft executive Mike Yabara explained that about 100 Xbox 360 titles will be playable on Xbox One by this holiday, with hundreds huh. more expected to follow. Yeah, it's the among same the thing first they did wave... with... Sorry, yeah. go ahead. Among, among the first wave will be Mass Effect Trilogy, Super Meat Boy, Halo Reach, and Perfect Dark Zero. See, it's the same thing they did with the 360 and the original Xbox. Like, Munch's Odyssey is for the Xbox, but you could also play it on the 360. There's a bunch of other games that they did that with. I think Unreal Tournament was one of the games that they did it with as well. But yeah, it's so it's not gonna be every game is backwards compatible. So and it looks like that Final Fantasy VII reboot is gonna be by the end of the year. Oh, cool. No. 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 2017. Oh, that's like two years from now. <laughs> screw that. <laughs> okay. I'll play it eventually, but I'll just screw that now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Well. Uh, Anyways, like I said, the live stream is going to be this Thursday. We're all going to be there. Yep. It's going to start at 9 a.m. Yay. Yay. <laughs> uh, social <Someone's> media. <laughs> <laughs> Check out our Facebook, our Twitter. Check out our Twitch. All of the videos that we've recorded so far on a stream are there. There's also a few highlights. Hopefully we'll be getting some more highlight videos out there. Depending oh, yeah. on how much it. time we have. Uh, what's up with TRS? What's been up with you guys? Uh, what's been up with me? Uh, Eden Eternal, Dragon Ball Z, Xeno or Dragon Ball Xenoverse. Looking at Digimon Adventure Tri News. Uh, Smite watching the SPL. Just normal week. Smite Pro. Oh, I'm by playing the way. Xenoverse. Xenoblade. Trying to 100% that game still. Ugh. So, uh, what's up with me is I've been. Working with my uh, my new associate for the Minecraft division division, not really thing, but uh, we're gonna probably do some recording of videos at some point this week. Uh, we've been practicing last week. Uh, you guys are always welcome in the server that we play in. You guys, I mean, you guys are always welcome if you want to join. Uh, Zach or. Sora obviously does not have a uh, uh, PC version of Minecraft. Yes. Um, so I've been trying to look at ways to get him that. So. Okay. And I do have PC. Yeah, I'll get on there eventually. But my work weeks kind of suck this week. I work 48 hours at the hotel and then I work 15 at the uh, YMCA. So Just I'm, choose one. <laughs> but I'm getting paid a lot, and come winter, apparently the hotel hours are going to drop a lot, so it's going to be nice uh, to have the two jobs. Plus, okay. the one job is within five minutes, ten minutes from my house, so I, I can't beat that. Yeah. Um, oh, did I show you guys this yet? What is it? Pokemon. It's got a glare. Adventures in the Orange Islands, a complete series. Really? Complete collection. It was nine dollars at where I work. Nice. Nice. I Which, by the way, I can I can no longer tell you guys exactly. One, I can't tell you what we have in stock, and two, I can't tell you exactly where I work on streams anymore. Okay. You weren't supposed to to begin with. Exactly. <laughs> okay. That's why I'm not saying where I work at. I'm mm -hmm. just saying the hotel. Yeah, but it's just my work has a new policy that I can't okay. do yeah. that. Yeah, that's that's totally fine. Whatever. Okay. Um, so yeah, I've been playing Minecraft, working a lot, sleeping. That's pretty. Sleeping much, is good. Pretty much my life. Yeah. So I, I'll hopefully do a 
a Minecraft video coming up here because I've been doing a lot of progress in my world and I think it's worth it. I might get my brother over and we might do a video. So just so I get somebody else over here because it, it does kind of suck filming by yourself and Boogan brought that up a little while ago because he had his, a couple of videos on our channel. But yeah, so that's that's kind of what's up with me. And what's the question of the week? Uh, should there be a real life Jurassic Park? Okay, and uh, we'll talk about that next week, but please leave your ideas below, uh, let us know what you think, and if you've seen Jurassic World, let us know what you thought about the movie, because it was great in my opinion. Um, I'm sure next week we'll definitely delve into it a little bit more, as Sora will have seen it by then, and I will have seen it twice. Boogan's already seen it. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't have anything else to say. Do you guys have anything? Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Remember, don't let people hit you and call me six. <laughs> okay, well, please make sure to like, comment, share us with your friends. We love you all. Thank you. Subscribe. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Okay, well, I'm doing a quick test here. His quick test is like five minutes. Oh, well. <laughs> uh. Guys! Guys, come back!